What is up, many guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy, and this is a big, big, big video. Looking forward to making this video for you guys so you guys can enjoy this because I know you will. So, we've got the Air Jordan 4, the Midnight Navy. Now, you guys know already I'm a sucker for Jordan 4s. I love Jordan 4s, they're just different silhouette, you know, they're just more, I guess, um, just more advanced compared to the Jordan 1s in terms of the technology. And boy, they just look so good, man. They're just chunky and just good looking. So I'll show you guys in a couple of seconds what I'm looking at. And bam, big ups to Soul Supply every single time. Guys, before I continue, let me just prompt you. If you haven't, please make sure you subscribe and also like this video because it helps little channels like mine to go up the algorithm so more people can watch and then I can do more giveaways because I make more money. So as you guys can see that this shoe comes in full family sizing so you can buy for yourself and your loved ones as well. And these shoes are simple, but they're effective. You know, um, it just takes little minor changes in the color, you know, um, to change these shoes. And people that love Jordan 4s, like I will be looking forward to this drop. These are gonna be profitable for resellers as well, but also for those like people that wanna to buy to wear them, you were able to, you know, uh, incorporate different colors with this um, drop as well. So I don't know where to start, to be honest. <laughs> so when it comes to cars, I love cars quite a lot. You guys know, you've seen my videos on, you know, on YouTube. If you haven't watched them, guys, please make sure you support and watch them as well. Much love. So I want to buy a Ferrari, which is a midnight navy. It's just one of those colors, which is just beautiful. It's subtle. But, you know, when you talk about Ferrari and Lamborghinis and those sort of cars, you tend to find you can put things like... Um, you can put like a, a texture to the paint, which, um, you know, when you look at the paint under the sun, you can see the speck and the little details, you know. So it's a color which I love quite a lot. And I think even like, you know, with cars like Range Rovers and whatnot, it's a color which matches. As long as you know how to spec a car, it's a lovely color. So what better, what better shoe to buy than this shoe as a person that likes this color as well. I've got the Oreos. You guys have seen them. I've got the... UNCs, you guys have seen them, and to get this as well, I think will be very good for the collection. So you've got pretty much an all white base on the shoe, and then you've got the plastics, which are different colors. So we'll start with the lace section over there. So um, on the lower lace section, just on the side there, you've got that midnight navy piece on the bottom, as well as on the top towards the tongue, um, which come in that midnight navy. So the top section there, which is Midnight Navy, is attached to a triangle, which comes in grey, finished off with the Midnight Navy sprinkles on there as well. It's a nice little pattern as well. And just next to the triangle on your left-hand side, you've also got the white netting with the white background as well. But you've also got bits of netting as well on the toe box on the front as well. Things also get a little bit more interesting as you go to the lower part of the shoe. So you've got the midsole that comes in three colors. So you've got midnight navy, then you've got gray, you've got a base of gray with the midnight sprinkles on it. Then you've also got white as well. Then you've also got a bubble on there as well. As we move to the ankle section, you've also got your typical, let me just um, get a picture. There we are, perfect. So as we move to the back there, then you've got those different colors incorporated on the back of the shoe which match the side of the shoe as well. The shoe is uniform, it feels complete. It's beautiful, it's very, uh, it's got that retro feel about it, but at the same time, you know, everything is all about, you know, bringing back, you know, the past into the future. So it blends in perfectly. There's many ways you can wear this shoe. A lot of you guys wear vintage stuff that you're watching and you can incorporate vintage stuff. You know, I'm talking varsity jackets, I'm talking hoodies, I'm talking, you know, um, baseball tops, you know, even baseball caps as well. If you're a Yankees fan, even if you're not a Yankees fan and you just go to New York, you can buy one of those new era caps, incorporate that into your outfit, wear maybe a blue um, puffer jacket, dark navy blue jacket, uh, yeah, dark navy blue hoodie, dark navy blue crew neck or sweater. Americans call this a hooded sweatshirt. You can wear this with some blue denim jeans that are nice and loose fitting. You put this on and you're looking fantastic. You're looking clean. It's a very clean shoe. You can't really mess it up. If you mess this shoe up, 
in terms of what you incorporate in your outfit, then I don't know what to tell you. So moving on to resaw, these we saw I think probably from 250. Obviously, certain sizes are key, they'll be more profitable. Do your research on StockX as well as other different um other different uh, platforms such as gold as well as other different platforms as well now be mindful obviously like uh, that towards christmas time you will see the price of these spike up as well um so you will see the spike up but maybe towards so probably say towards mid-november so when you buy these you can afford to sit on them a little bit um obviously be mindful that inflation and the economy is in a recession so we are seeing the effect of the macro factors on the reseller market. So the prices, you know, we used to get the resale price that we used to get like a year ago. You know, that's a thing of the past. So be aware that, you know, that can affect the, the price, you know, when it comes to resale. So what I'm giving you is kind of like, um, you know, the, uh, the skeleton. So you've got to then go and do your research, look at the resale price and, you know, put the meat to the skeleton yourselves so guys um i think that's pretty much it it covers everything i think yeah good for resale good for buying for yourself lovely shoe i'll be buying for myself and guys i'm away thanks for watching hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video have a good night a piss